All right, welcome back, everyone. Jason and Karen are joining us here from the Columbus Lounge Humane Society. Great to have both of you here. Good to be here. here. You brought some friends with you who we're going to meet in just a we moment, did. but uh, we want to give folks any updates that you have out there that they need to know about. Uh, just everything's going pretty good. Got mm -hmm. plenty of animals to adopt at the shelter. Um, I just want to point out um, we do have a low cost spay neuter program. It's mm -hmm. 35 for cats, 45 for dogs. Saying that, mm -hmm. cats usually we'll take in 50. 75 cats throughout the winter, but when April hits, it's 250 plus cats a month, and wow. that's primarily kittens. So if you have a cat that's not spayed, now's the time to do it mm -hmm. if you want to take advantage of our program because if we, if you can get them in now and, mm -hmm. and get them taken care of because when when springtime rolls around, you're going to have a whole mm -hmm. lot of kittens coming All in. All right, so. that's good advice mm -hmm. then. I understand during the Christmas season, you had quite a bit of adoptions, which is a good thing, mm -hmm. uh, but the and you still have many more that need good homes. Right. There's there's never enough homes, you know. Mm -hmm. at, we do a great job with adoptions. Um, people come from all around. I mean, someone came from five hours today to get a dog. Um, but you can't save them all. If so, we need your help with spaying and neutering. So you mm -hmm. also always need supplies there mm -hmm. uh, at the shelter. What kind of supplies do you ask people to bring in? Um, you're cleaning. We would go through tons of paper towels, obviously, mm -hmm. a lot. <laughs> I wonder why. <laughs> dishwashing liquid mm -hmm. and, and detergent. washing mm -hmm. detergent. Um, that's a must. Um, and then dog food and cat food. Mm -hmm. We try to stick with the pedigree and Purina brands because mm -hmm. we don't want to upset their stomach. Right. So and cat litter. Cat, cat, cat litter. Always cat litter. Karen, a lot of people like to come and actually volunteer their services yes. there. What sort of things do you have people volunteer? Well, we doing? love for volunteers to come help on site and off site for our adoption drives and everything. Mm -hmm. Our biggest need, though, would be foster homes. Oh. If someone's interested in taking a sweet little, like this one right here is very shy, mm -hmm. you know, someone could take it home for a couple of weeks, foster it, help mm -hmm. it come out of its shell a little bit, okay. something like that. We really need foster really? homes. Really? Okay. Mm -hmm. And do you have any special requirements for foster? Homes. There's a form to fill out. Mm -hmm. We just require vetting be current on your current pets. Okay. Well, mm -hmm. let's see who uh, Karen and Jason mm -hmm. have brought today uh, that are up for adoption at mm -hmm. the Humane Society. First is, who's this little guy? This is little John. Um, he is three years old. He's a Chihuahua Terrier mix. Mm -hmm. His owner moved away and was unable to take him. He needs a quiet, calm home. He mm -hmm. is very shy, mm -hmm. but so sweet once he gets to know you. All right. And he is. He's been very shy here yes. this morning. Yes. All right, and who's this guy? And this is a cute little puppy. What was his name? Petey. Petey. Mm -hmm. Keep forgetting his name. Petey's been very calm, too, yeah, but Petey's you say calm. you assure me when you put him on the floor, he'll be all over the yes. studio. Yes. Uh, he's, he's probably a little beagle mix, if I had to guess, so it's going to stay small to medium size. Mm -hmm. All right, and the process for adoption, remind uh, us real quick. You can fill out a pre-adoption application online mm -hmm. through our website or just come to the shelter and, mm -hmm. and do that. and. 65 bucks and you make them walk out with a new pet. All right, if you think one of these will fit well in your home or just go down to the Humane Society, you can find puppies and kittens there. Uh, thank you both for being here. We appreciate thank it as you. always. There's a number on your screen, 327-3107. Stay with us. We'll be right back.